Which one is the king? Salt or pepper? I'm here with Mothman Tate, future chef. Tate, if you could only have one, salt or pepper, which one would it be? Um, pepper. That's not what I thought you would say. I put salt on my everything, okay? So the only way that we can see which seasoning is better if you put it on stuff that doesn't belong. The winner will be the one that tastes worst best, worst best. So that's exactly what we're gonna be doing today. Let's have a again! Banana with pepper. Oh, I didn't mm, taste mm. it. Mm, mm, mm. I can't taste it. Yeah, I'll try another. I'm actually about to throw up right now. <laughs> I don't taste anything. I give that a zero out of 10. I, I give that like a nine out of 10. Banana with salt. No, mm -mm. no. One out of 10. Oh, I give that an eight out of 10. Chocolate chip cookie dough ice cream? Cheers. You know, I didn't really taste it at all. Um, four out of 10. Five out of 10. No. Mm-mm. I swallowed it. I think a three out of 10. I kind of agree with him. Okay, we're trying cherries with salt and pepper. Actually, that looks really good. Yeah, it does. I think I need to try another one. It's like someone just dumped grass all over your lemonade. Three out of 10. Probably a two out of 10. Next up is salt and cherries. Okay, we actually had to go spit that out. That was so nasty. That was disgusting. Zero out of 10. Zero out of 10. It's peach yogurt. First out, pepper. Mm, it works. Mm. I give that a five out of 10. I do five out of 10, yeah. Next up, salt. All right, we had to run to spit that out too. Okay, that just surprised me. I agree. I like salt more, but it turns out if you just add salt to yogurt or cherries, it just tastes like pee. I'm sorry, it's a little gross, but it's just... Gotta be honest. Pepper, pepper wins. Pepper. From a chef perspective, I don't think I'm gonna use salt for a while. It's traumatizing. It scarred me. See you guys later. Make sure to always have pepper.